Arbin, homered here yesterday, nearly homered in his last at bat. Another 0-2. For the first time since 1998, Mississippi State headed to Omaha in the College World Series. And you know everybody's sitting on the edge of their seats right now because with his next base hit, he will break the all-time career hits record in the southeastern conference now the pitch and it's hit in the air and that is shallow down the right field line gonna be a tough play can't make the play it drops in there for a base hit runner will go to third another to second the first baseman sullivan trying to run it down over his head and that's a little pop fly that is in there for number 353 and jake mango has just broken the Southeastern Conference career hits record. The drive deep to left, way back, it is gone! It is gone! A grand slam for Masters! A grand slam for Masters! Paul Bubby. First pitch is hit high and deep in the outfield. Way back, Mike go. Gone for a home run. Come on to live to play another day. Unbelievable. Dickerson keeps the dog's hopes alive. Guys, that ball is hit into left. They're going to send the run. Here comes the throw. His average has dipped all the way down to 240. But the big fella can put all that behind him right here with one swing of the bat. First pitch, fly ball right side. Jamison on the run. Sophomore Tarkington out of Searcy, Arkansas. Base hit to the left side. They're going to send the run. Here comes Britt. The throw high. Not in time. The It turns to the back, has a tag, and Mississippi State will dog pile. The Bulldogs are going back to the College World Series. On the ground to third. Elijah McNamee, he was running right into him. Gilbert off the glove. And it gets away. Mississippi State has rallied. They score four in the bottom of the ninth and shock Auburn. They win it 5-4. In the top of the ninth to allow Notre Dame to tie it back up again. So... 
at least nobody has to worry about losing the game on a on, on a fielding error. Team center field. Back goes Stanley. It's gone! Bring on Clemson! A leadoff home run in the bottom of the ninth inning for Ty Martin. Mississippi State wins it. They move on! A bottom of the ninth. Butch needs a strikeout in the worst sort of way. And there's a ball head in the air, deep to left field, back, 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 and it goes out of the yard for a grand slam game winner for Andy Weiss. He took it the other way, and he circles the bases, a grand slam, which is a game winner. Andy Weiss, who's had a tough year, but what a great moment for the junior from Amy. And the pitch coming. Ball is in the air, in the gap, right center field, all the way to the wall. Mangum to third, across the plate is Anderson. Here he comes, here he comes, he scores. Bulldogs have won it in walk-off fashion by a score of seven to six over Ole Miss. Uh, man, I think you're gonna see a big difference. Colton Ledbetter pulls this one to right, and got The Sanford transfer, and now Hunter Hines pulls this one to right, down the line toward the pole, and gone! Back to back for the Bulldogs in the sixth. hit sharply but the shortstop's got to play at second base and this game is over first he's on the move a line or rather a fly ball into right center field now we're going to have a throwback opportunity here and this game is over on the double play there's a fly ball deep to right the second of the night for Hunter Hines and State breaks it open in the bottom of the eighth the power has been turned back on. Hunter Hines just put a charge into that one. White just tried to put one in play. Hits that ball in the right field. Dakota Jordan back. He reaches up and Mississippi State. It's a little bit early looking for it. Now two straight sliders, and that could end it. This might be it. It is. The Bulldogs have done it. They are heading to Omaha for the third consecutive. at the bottom of the zone. Jordan hits a really good pitch here. And then just drives it 416 feet to dead center field. Red on slider all the way. Here's a 2-1. That ball is matched. See you later. My goodness. Just went 430 feet. Oh my. Well, that woke the dude up. Well, and that's what the Bulldog fans wanted to see. Dakota. And ball high and inside. And Mississippi State has run ruled LSU. 15 to 5 in the Sunday game. And State takes two out of three from LSU.